Welcome to the project demonstration of fire exhausting robot. In this project we are using one Arduino Uno to control the fire robot and here we are connecting this Arduino Uno by using this Bluetooth module HC05 by one app in our mobile phone that is Bluetooth terminal HC05 name is bluetooth terminal hc05 this is the app and here for controlling the whole process we are using this arduino you know and the arduino you know can be connected to our mobile phone directly so external bluetooth module is used hc05 bluetooth module is used and here we are using flame sensor to detect fire and indicate to the relay to on and Whenever there is any fire detected, then automatically this relay will be on. The this relay is connected to this motor and the battery in series, and it is working as a switching circuit. Whenever there is any there is any fire detected, then automatically the relay will be on, and the supply will be gone to the motor, and the water will be thrown by this pipe. From the bottle, the the container, and here we are using one amp twelve volts battery, which will give supply to this whole robot. And this robot is controlled by the Arduino you know, by the connection of connecting of connection of the L two nine three D, which is L two nine three D motor driver, which is used to control the motor by using this mobile application. And when we given small f, it will go forward, and when we give small b, it will go backward, and when we give uh, small r, it will go right, and for small l, it will go left. And to stop the motor, we are using uh, small s. By using these commands, it will be controlled. And uh, this Arduino, you know, is mainly used to control this robot. And this the uh, uh, fire sensor is directly connected to this relay. And whenever there is any fire detected, automatically this motor will be on. And let us see the demonstration now. For before uh, demonstration, first you go to Bluetooth app, Bluetooth app, Bluetooth uh, settings, and before that, install this app Bluetooth Terminal HC05 or Serial Blue Serial Bluetooth Terminal. By Serial Bluetooth Terminal is available in a Play Store. and then on the circuit then go to bluetooth settings and here you can see the hc05 is appeared as a connect new connection pair it and for pairing it will ask the password 1 2 3 4 this is the password for the pairing bluetooth device and then okay then it will be paired to your mobile phone and go to the bluetooth application serial terminal and when you go click on this three lines and go to devices and click on hc05 and here you can see connected to hc05 now it is connected to the hc05 and now i want to move the robot to forward for f backward stop forward stop and you can see here for forward small f command is given and for backward small b command is given for stop small s command is given like that the commands will be there and uh, to make it right uh, to turn it right r will be applied and to stop it we are using stop like this the robot will be controlled and to on the fire To on this fire, fire exhausting motor, just you whenever they, there is any fire detected, automatically it will be on. And you can see here the one is light indication is there. Then automatically the light will be on. Like this, the motor will pump the water from this pipe to the exhaust water. like this motor will be controlled and we will have a command like this 
and now i am just want to move forward and uh, or left it will go left and whenever there is any disruption is ever had this to restart the motor then automatically it will be connected by clicking on this three lines go devices and click on hc05 then it will be connected directly and go left and stop like this the motor can be controlled let us see the demonstration on the flow for moving forward i am clicking on small f backward left right left and stop this is the controls we can give from our mobile phone to the Arduino you know by using bluetooth module and like this we can control the motor and uh, whenever there is any fire detected then automatically it will be give given signal to the motor and we can listen the sound and uh, there will be a light indication in the this relay like this we can control this motor thank you